first attempt at this episode was thwarted by nine crashes. Just getting back to where we left off pre-release. So, here's what you missed. We flew the ship out of Avernus, but it turns out we really suck at flying, so we crashed the ship out of Avernus, and while crashing, we fell out of the ship. But fortunately, the little slug in our head decided to save our asses. We found our companion, Shadow Heart, the half-elf cleric. Asterion, the dastardly rogue. And we killed our captor for good measure. We pulled the hat out of the magician. Decided to leave Lazel behind. Learned a little bit about Gale, the wizard. Asterion, the rogue. And flirted with Shadow Heart, the cleric. We met Tall, Dark, and Handsome, punched a kid in the face for being a general dick, learned that Tall, Dark, and Handsome was on the ship with us, and then met the queen bitch who decided she wanted everybody out of her kingdom and was going to feed this child to her pet snake. We convinced her otherwise. The wizard thought that was a good idea. Shadowheart agreed as well. But now, back to the interesting stuff. All right, so here we are back in it. And uh, after that little oh, malfunction sister. from last episode, we are headed this direction to uh, hopefully get some answers. I know that this is the makeshift prison, so we've just got to... No, I didn't want to close the door on my companions. You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. She can't fight back. That's the point. Get out of the way! She didn't kill your brother, Arca. You're better than this. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. If you ever had it to begin with. I'll step in between them. Looks like the Absolute sent me a protector. You're gonna kill him too? You, move! Let's see, how about uh, intimidation? You lower your crossbow or I'll deliver you to your brother. I made it. Damn you, damn it. Why do you care if a goblin lives or dies? Because she's not a practice target. If she dies, everything she knows will be taken to the grave. If you believe anything the beast tells you, you're an idiot. It's all right, Arca. Let's go. You're gonna be sorry! Every last one of you! How do I talk to her? Not for communal use, it seems. Best show some respect. Or some more cunning. I just want to talk to the damn... Oh, okay. Ain't sure why you're protecting me. <laughs> Don't care, neither. It's too late to make friends warg me. My tribe's coming. They're gonna burn this pretty place for the glory of the Absolute and hang you by your guts. Hmm. I don't care about gratitude. Goddess. We're burning her name across the face of the world, we are. The absolute is gold from the sky, she is. The blessing in the storm and the storm itself. You've got my interest. Have any holy literature on you? Um, an all-powerful goddess that can't get you out of a cage? Maybe she sent you to help me. And you will, if you want to save your skin. And if the teeth stick a few arrows in us on the way out of here, don't worry. Priestess Gut will patch us up. Got a whole lab set up, cooks up potions that fix our lads, no matter how much of a beating they take. Could probably stick your head back on if someone was to chop it off. <gasps> Mighty Booyog. A goblin healer. We really are desperate, aren't we? Hmm. Let's see. Uh, well, I'd certainly like to meet her. Get me out of here, and I'll tell you where to find her. Deal? You've already told me what I need to know. I'll find the priestess myself. <laughs> Even if you did find my tribe, they'd set the wargs on you. You need me. Get me out of here, and I'll tell them what a good friend you are. Uh, yeah, we're gonna help the goblin, I think. Then hurry up and do it. 
My tribe ain't as friendly as I am. Oh, you teeths are all boring. Even your cages are. You gonna open this cage or what? Uh, just be patient. I'll Maria, break soon enough. I got all the time in the world. You don't. Um. I'm gonna bite one the of my characters has knocked. Tiring business, isn't it? Well, why don't we take a little break? Hmm? Allow ourselves a few moments of rest. Gives me a chance to talk to you about something. Well. Rather important. Rather important? All right, go ahead. We've been on the road together for a while now, haven't we? Hmm? Survived some perils, overcame some obstacles. Ever since you were kind enough to free me from that stone, I've seen you demonstrate remarkable guile and courage. The way you stood in front of a crossbow to prevent a murder. The way you got Korga to release the girl. In short, I've grown to trust you. Um... That's gratifying to hear. The reason I make a point of saying this is that I've grown confident enough to tell you something I've yet to tell another living soul, except for my cat. You see, I have this condition, very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. What kind of condition? The specifics are rather personal, but suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with, though not without some effort. What it comes down to is this. Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. Your illness causes you to consume raw magic? I'm going to need details. I can say no more on the matter. Not now, anyway. Just trust me when I say it's all of vital importance. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact, and before we were abducted. It's only a matter of time before my craving returns. That is why I turn to you. I need you to help me find magic items to consume. It is vital. Dare I say it? Critical. Where do you suggest we find the artifacts you need? We've already done the finding. In fact, you have one in your possession. You know for yourself how hard won such an item was, and it will be no easier when even more are required to assuage my hunger. There'll be danger involved, or great cost. Um, I expected as much. Don't worry, I'm happy to help. Splendid. Bit of boldness will serve us well. I'm sure we won't have to look very far to find what I need. Faerun overflows with magic-infused treasure. As do our packs, as a matter of fact. We have such an item already in our possession. Primed for the moment the need arises. I hope I can count on you. Yeah, you can count on me. Now let's switch to Gale, because I'm yes. pretty sure he has knock. I thought he learned knock. Damn it, I thought he learned knock. Whatever comes. Did Shadowheart learn ready. knock? Just Starian. Oh, Starian has a level up. Let's level him up really quick. Chosen subclass, Arcane Trickster. So I should get two uh, cantrips. <clears throat> oh, I can change it. Uh, assassinate initiative. I don't know, Arcane Trickster seems like it would be a good one. Thief is always good. Hmm. Assassinate. Any successful attack roll against a surprise creature is a critical hit. Assassin's Alacrity. Quick as an alley cat in the rain dark city, you immediately restore an action and bonus action at the start of combat. You immediately restore your action and bonus action at the start of combat. I'm not sure I understand. Okay. Let's look at the spells really quick. Dancing lights, 
friends, shocking grass, ray of frost, poison spray, acid splash, light, minor illusion, true strike. Uh, true strike is always a good one. What about spell? Charm person, color spray, disguise self, cautious, hideous laughter, sleep. And expanded, you can add a wizard spell of your choice to your list. Honestly, I think I'd rather have an assassin. I don't. Screw it. Arcane Trickster is what the game told us that it was taking. We're going to stick with that. So cantrips, we're going to go with. Through Strike. And Blade Ward. Spells, we're going to do. Tasha's Hideous Laughter and Leap Expanded, we're going to do Ice Knight. <sighs> Sorry, that took a moment. Sorry, every last one of you. Oh, skeleton key. Total bonus plus 11, Jesus. So I, I basically do it as long as I don't roll a, a one. Oh, you teeth are all boring. Even your cages are boring. Bloody teeths everywhere. Okay. Ready to go meet my tribe? Just say the word. Uh... Follow Happily. me. Lead the way. Is there a... Uh, rotting basket. Now I'm curious. Wing... Is there a way out of here? Without... Uh, okay, so... Wonder if the gods are watching me. Can she crouch too? Thank you. I can't waste any more time. Light on my feet. Mm. I miss yeah. my forge. Shame the goblins didn't yeah. find me, too. Let's see. Don't say that. I'm just sad yeah. and bored. Yeah. Is there a way? That way is probably not an option. Shoes. Well, where are my boots? Again. Swing and swing and parry. No. And... Ah. And again. Swing and swing and. Oh. Ah. Hmm. Well, looks like we're going to have to make a run for it. And see how far we get. Let's be on my way.
Uh. You've been caught breaking the rules. You have a horrible feeling the next thing broken might be your skull. Try to talk your way out of it. Deception. Come on. Damn it. Wait a second. The goblin is the one doing the... For fuck's sake. Usually, this is the point where the guard leaves you alone. But not today. Gold may have made your problem go away this time, but next time you won't be so lucky. Okay. Now this time, why don't you stay your with us? Your rescue attempt has been noticed. Choose your next move carefully. Quiet, she's gonna help me destroy her old camp. I hope this one works. Yes! You are persuasive enough. You and the goblin are free to go. Okay. All right, goblin, now? you sir. Can't slow down. Breathe quiet. Move with care. If not over, then through. Joking about soup just a moment ago. Come on, Rick. So, do you have loves waiting for you once this is all over? You know what? That is not the easiest of questions for me to answer. You mean just waiting? Like a lovesick puppy? Short term amusements are much less hassle. Ah, thought I was never gonna get out of there. Good to be free again, gotta say. All right. No one deserves to be locked up like that. Uh, sure they don't. I'll introduce you to my whole tribe and put in a good word for you. See you at the camp. Okay. You know we'll just really follow her for the most game? part. The food. Freshest fish I've ever had. I don't care for fish. Red means now. That's a different matter. Rare as can be. Dripping. Well, unless we find a cure, you won't have any teeth to chew it with soon enough. Okay, so... Looks like we've got a fight on our hands, some bandits. I told them to run, the idiots! You better turn north here, or you'll end up like them. Thought you was busy with the lads in Elson's Grove. Sucker punching strangers. That's your bit, right? Still Wasn't sorry any about of your that? business, though, was it? Didn't think this contract could go any worse. Then you showed up. What was the contract? The kind that leaves half your crew dead. There's a wizard in Boulder's Gate that will pay gobloads for a relic. Supposedly buried round these parts, but gold ain't any use if you're too cold to spend it. Let's say I want that gold. Where would I find the relic? It's called the Night Song. It's supposed to be hidden under the temple where the goblins jumped us. I'd give you a map of the temple and wish you a happy funeral. But my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own sodger. Goblins made sure to the fat old chunk. All I've got's the contract. Can show you where we turn back if you feel like dying. I do feel like dying. Thanks, I'll take it. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'll be well on my way to Boulder's Gate when you die. I'm just glad to be rid of the bloody thing. Happy hunting. Thank you. Come on. Okay. Oh, time. So, this thing. Read. Uh. For perilous and profitable quest, Master Lorcan, the Arcanist of Athalta, 
Afkala from this tower seeks brave and enterprising the night song preservation in Baldur's Gate okay oh we will head on this way we something's waiting up ahead okay something is awaiting up ahead so we will walk right into that goblin trap I know you're there. Show yourselves. You spotted us. Good. It's like they say. No fun in skewing a pig what doesn't know he's cooked. There'll be no skewing happening here. Now let me pass. We got you surrounded. Here's how this goes. You take one step further and we'll fill your front with arrows. Or you turn around and your backside gets the same treatment. A strange symbol glows marked on their flesh, and something within you stirs in response. Um. Illithid wisdom, stand down now. Ha ha! I get advantage, so. You're a true soul, but my mistake, sir. A true shiver soul. runs across your mind. You feel sated. You'll get no more trouble from us. Promise. Do you have someone waiting for you in Baldur's Gate, Astarian? A sweetheart, perhaps? Not one in particular. The city is a veritable feast of sweethearts. You must be eager to get back then. Slimmer pickings out in this wilderness. Ooh. Treasure. Asterion. Don't touch me. <laughs> Easy. Just pick the lock, I'm curious. Perfect. You seemed quite forward with your compliments earlier. We don't need this mess. Seize the day, I say. Haste town. More now than ever. Careful you don't pull a muscle in your haste. Ooh. Well, there's something for Gale to, uh, to use or something for me to wear. We'll start with me wearing it, and if Gale needs it, so then Gale needs it. Carry me. Lots of loot and stuff to go through, but I'll do that off of um, off camera for now. So the tadpole allows us to influence others. How very interesting. Don't get too excited. Influence comes at a cost. And until we know what that cost is, the only reasonable approach is a cautious one. <clears throat> you have the ability to manipulate people, make them bend to your every whim, and you'd be cautious about it. <laughs> That's no fun. <laughs> uh, if power comes from these parasites, it can't be trusted. Such powers of manipulation could be useful, and it makes our enemies more malleable. All the better. My point exactly. I'm so glad you agree. I don't agree entirely, Asterion. There's... No bodies listening. <laughs> Look what we got here. Another little birdie wanting to fly. Stop this thing! <laughs> Flap those wings some more and I'll feed you a worm. And you. Hope you got a stomach for rights. What in the hells are you doing? What's it bloody look like? We're teaching this here pipsqueak to fly. Let me rephrase that. Why are you doing this? Cause it makes me laugh. 
It does look funny, I'll admit. Mind if I stay and watch? Uh, fun's over, release the gnome. You want this little cave lurking, what's it? <laughs> Not a... The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is beyond reach until you rest. Hmm. All of you lot against me. A deep loan, you should find a better target. Perfect. Yeah. I reckon we could do better than this run, eh? We're leaving. What about the gnome? Ain't we supposed to bring him to... I said we're leaving! There's plenty of sport and rich pickings out there for us. All right, then. Fresh meat. Scared meat. Yes. Huh. Now how do I get him down? Uh, is there like a... Some way to get in? Well, there's a door over here. Over here. Oh, oh, oh. Shadowheart's attention is fixed on a damaged old statue. We should keep moving. Another episode? Why does this keep happening to you? You already know as much as I do. Best ignore it. As long as it doesn't hamper us too much. Hmm. Now, how the hell do I stop this thing? I'm trying to figure out how. Knock it off. Uh, just check for Ooh, camp supplies. Alchemist fire. Grease bottle. Ooh, yeah. I'm trying to figure out how. Very clever. There we go. Hey, how fortuitous. We stopped it with what him at the bottom. For? Cut me loose. Uh, free him. This all been a deep gnome. Strange. Uh. Bag of Kamara. There's pustulant thugs. Well, get on with it. Get on you with saved me. Now you'll extort me. That's how this works, yes? I'd r uh, you owe me nothing. Nothing? I'd rather know how you got caught. Uh, my own fault, really. I should have dropped my pack and outrun those bastards. Alas. Take my pack, if you can find it. The only reason those goblins caught me was its weight. I'll travel lightly from now on. Uh, you're a little too far from home, Deep Ignorance Gnome. Ignorance is alive and well, it seems. Deep Gnomes aren't restricted to the Underdark, you know. I've lived in Baldur's Gate for years. I'm in search of a friend. I fear he's in trouble. See this? I gave it to him years ago before I left home. I found it around the neck of a thug in the lower city. It was speckled with blood. My friend, nowhere to be found. But I still have hope. I have reason to believe he's in the Underdark. Hopefully I'll pick up his trail from there. I always help my friends. On that note, <clears throat> I bid thee farewell. If we should meet again, well, we will have met again. Hmm. 
kind of like that outlook. If we meet again, if we meet again, we will have met again. That's great. Um, all right, there was a door back here. I don't know exactly what was there. Ooh. Okay. Heavy backpack, heavy chest. Don't need that. There's a heavy backpack. Smoke powder. Ooh. Oh. And more stuff that Gale can eat. But that's medium armor. So let's take all and make sure. Let's see. She can wear medium armor, right? Yeah. Right? Perfect. And then where'd that smoke powder go? The smoke powder, I feel, would probably be best in Asterian's grip. And basic poison also in Asterian. The alchemist fire, probably also Asterian. The grease bottle I'm going to give to Gale. The antidote, also a sterian. Uh, I want to put all my camp supplies in camp supplies, please. Potion of healing, intellect of our cerebellum. Uh, sterian is the one with the really good archery skills. So we'll do that. Not sure what this soul coin is, but I guess we'll keep it for now. Brave Enfeeblement is probably better in Asterion's hands than the Scroll of Grease. That way, everybody has the ability to cast Grease or throw Grease in some way, shape, or form. Burning Hands, I'm going to give to uh, Shadow Heart as well. Keep the Revivify. The Mage Armor, I'm going to keep for me, because I think Gale can already cast that so we're good there anything else wooden trunk no anything nope we're good and wait a second about that statue What the hell did I just do? Shove. Okay. We can light a candle, I guess. Don't know what it's for, but... Whoa. I hate it when it does that. Part of me wishes it would kind of lock to your character so you couldn't accidentally move it out of the way, but... I get it. over this way a necklace not to my taste certainly up the old key can't talk to that goblin that's not useful calcified web all right I'll bite torch go equip throw can I extinguish okay 
let's not toast our companions. Why is my strike? Oh, my bad. I'm very curious about this calcified web. Whoops. All right, let's go out this way. Dated instruction. Weapon blueprints. A master blacksmith's work. Not too refined here. Just quick ideas sketched out. All right, I'm curious. I didn't mean to interrupt. Smash! Oh, smash! Yo! Oh, fuck no. I have a half ogre in the making. <laughs> well, that's disturbing. Um, let's just like old times. Hide and then move and we'll end your turn shadow heart we're going to use that scroll of grease as far in here as we night okay and then we'll get you over here and turn he slip yes Ellis Rebuke. All right. You are going to have to. Okay. And then we're going to haul ass back here because you are our glass cannon. Go from here. And you have four hit points left, so. Wait, how did I miss with a true strike? I disengage. He gets an attack of opportunity. And then enter. Sterian. We're going to run you around here. And then firebolt. That guy. My faith will protect Good me. there. Then ranged attack. Why am I missing this guy? She's got 41 hit points. Tell us rebuke. I'm not ah. No, I think not. Let's see. She. Chromatic orb on her. We're going to do a chromatic orb of. Thunder, yeah. How did I miss? I don't understand. Falling ass. Still breathing, despite everything. Uh, I have one hit point left. Sweet Jesus. Uh. Can 
gonna drink a potion. And Eldritch Blaster. Hey, oh damn. That's right, I have the knockback one. I forgot. Going to move back a little bit. Staring, it's going to be your turn. We're going to do Tasha's hideous laughter. And then we're going to end our turn. Shadow Heart. I'm going to have to ask you to Guiding Bolt. What's that lever? Only a few hit points, so she's stuck laughing. Now I can move Gale back. And she has 24 hit points or less. Let's knock her out. She only has 24. Er, you won't let me. Okay, fine. Second level slot. It won't let me do that neither. Uh, okay, Thunder Wave. I don't think that hit her at all. Another fight. Whoops. Let's go. That got her attention. Have to keep going. All right, Asterion. Now we need you to do... Can't target self? Oh, okay. Target Shadowheart. Now Shadowheart. orb we'll do thunder again we might actually survive this one I'll be damned going. hope your soul is in good hands <laughs> walk in on a bugbear and an ogre no I can honestly say I didn't Let's think so either far behind us what the hell's in here mangled corpse Scroll of Flaming Spear. We'll take it. We Not really it. worried about any of the... God, uh, any of the other stuff. Um, Javelin. Morning Star. Uh, hyena here. We can pick that up. And we'll take those. Yeah, I'm good not doing that again, and that's going to be where we call it today. If you enjoyed the content and aren't completely disturbed as I am, uh, you know exactly what to do. Thank you very much to my patrons for your support in uh, teaching me some of these spells that have saved our asses so far, but I won't keep you any longer. Thank you very much for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.